Hello, good day, all my friends. I'm Oliver from Token Hobby. Let's see how to operate this uh, loader from MT model. Uh, it is uh, WA480, and uh, we already start and connect it. Let's see the basic operation. So, and let's go back to the. So, this is the front page. From here, you press in model this button, keep pressing two seconds, we are go to setting. So this is all this channel. Yeah. Here auxiliary channel. Click inside, you will see each channel for which controlling. So one, two, four channel, it is fixed, no showing here. So channel one, it is for steering. Channel 2, it is for lifting big arm and lower big arm. Channel 3, it is for tilting the bucket and forklift. Channel 4, it is used for throttle. So now sound system not start, cannot drive. Only after start sound system, you will be able to start driving. Channel 5, it is VRB, that's the pump. Channel 6, that's uh, quick connection, quick connection, quick uh, release for the bucket. Now it is unlocked. Locked. Okay, for channel seven, it is controlled by SWG, so it is controlling the fork wideness. You can increase the pump load. That's for changing the wideness, that's channel 7. Okay, so now the channel 8, VRC, it is controlling the sound system. It is this one, the horn, engine start, sound. So after engine start, channel 4 you can use for driving. The driving motor only can start after sound system start. Okay, channel 8, that's VRD, that's for this one, will be light. Check. On. And also backlight. Also on. If you change direction, will be another light. Flashing. S slow flashing. Off. Okay, we will keep it slow flashing. And uh, channel 10, it is SWA. This one is the warning light. You can change different mode. Okay, so that's all the channel, only have 10 channel. So we will go back. So from here, you see, keep pressing. From here you will see which channel is moving, how much throttle, how much end points. So at this position, check this, uh, this switch. At this position, I will switch off the sound, so we are not moving away. Channel 4, it is for the driving throttle. Now it is only 32%, means now it is low speed. I change to here. Now it is 69% for channel 4, so now it's driving more fast. Also this one, you can adjust the engine endpoints. So when the sound is off, you press this one to higher endpoints for the throttle, you will be able to go to settings. Volume so, adjustment, exit settings. Access settings, 690% for channel 4. Go inside settings. Settings. Volume adjustment. Volume adjustment and the steering, it is for changing. Increase volume. Already maximum. Decrease volume. Decrease volume. Decrease volume. Increase volume. Increase volume. Engine sound. Change engine sound. Okay, we will leave like this. Horn sound. Horn sound. Sound of turning signal off. On. Keep it on. Sound of reversing drive. Reversing drive. Off. On. Keep it on. Turbine sound on off. On. Language. English. 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 
Okay, keep volume pressing. adjustment, increase volume. That's all the settings. And keep pressing forward. We are engine sound, exit settings. Access settings. So start the engine sound, you will start driving. Wait, totally start. Also, now mix control, you see it's moving slowly for the pump and the pressure is low. You can increase, start a little bit the pump. So the pump, when you're making mix control, will be higher motor speed and the pressure. Okay, and uh, switch off the pump. One more thing is I forgot about the differential lock. We still have one more. It is the differential lock. We will check. It is channel 11. So, unlock channel 11, pressure uh, this differential lock. It is locked now. Okay, unlock it. Okay, that's all the operation and the basic settings for this loader. So for others, uh, not always using, but you also can check by yourself for the end points, sub trim and the reverse. Uh, yeah, it's all here. So go out, model, keep pressing. You can choose from here to see the settings. Okay. Thank you, we will see each other again, bye bye.